watching Johnny Hockey. I just, I have to talk about this. I know I just made an Arbor Jack Eye video two days ago, but I have to talk about this. If you haven't seen this already, pause this video or wait until it's done and go watch it. You have to go watch the video on Sportsnet's YouTube channel titled Arbor Jack Eye's Unlikely Road to the NHL. After the Horn, I think the segment is called. It's just a must watch and man, I got emotional. I got chills from it because it's it's such an incredible story. And I commented down below that like the best part about this is you can truly see how genuinely good of a person Arbor Jack I is. And it's ironic. It's funny because he's one of the toughest and probably most intimidating even his young career players in the entire league. And I just, man, I love this kid so much. And he's so grateful to be a Hab. Like he talked about it with Friedman, how he, he held his breath putting the jersey on for the first time. Like, clearly the kid is so grateful and happy to be Montreal Canadian he also told the story before when he came in the league with Slaff and Gooley um, and there's somebody else that slipped in my mind and just saying wow like I can't believe we're doing this and you can tell he's soaking it in he's so grateful for this moment and you gotta love a kid like that and it's not hard to see why when you look at his parents in the feature the story's just incredible right like um, his parents fleeing from Yugoslavia in 19 19- 89 to come here and I mean his dad getting set up in Hamilton not knowing a word of English and working in the steel mill like oh man just the respect I have for that and his mom like they showed his mom still works at Costco changing tires you know how much of a grueling job that must be for her like They were working so hard. Even Arbor, the famous story, he worked at Costco before he made the NHL here. And he talked about one of the first things he wants to do when he can is retire his parents because they've worked so hard for him. And, uh, I mean, going from his dad, whose name is Jack Jackeye, by the way, which is just a sweet name, um, and him saying how proud he is not only to have a second generation Uh, son of an immigrant, make it to the National Hockey League, but him not knowing a word of English, and his son ending up playing for his favorite team, the Montreal Canadiens. You just can't write a better script, a better story uh, than what is shown here. And of course, there's a lot more stuff than that. They go into Arbor's journey himself and how hard he had to work. But I just wanted to highlight the part about his parents, how hard they worked to get Arbor where he needed to be. And they instilled that work ethic in him. And clearly, the appreciation in him. Like I don't think he will ever underestimate or forget Uh, how amazing it is that he's a Montreal Canadian and exactly what P.K. Subban showed the other day in his appreciation and we saw it with Arbor himself when he was flashing the logo after his tussle the other day with Adam Lowry it's just great stuff and you can't not love this guy it's amazing stuff here and a great story make sure you guys go watch that video Uh, I can't recommend it enough and it's gonna show you so much about Arbor's character and his parents character And um, he's got a fan for life in me right here. I love this. If you're new here, you know what to do. Like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out. You, thanks for watching Johnny Hockey.